We are still at the National Assembly as the leadership says it stands ready to partner with the executive arm of government using every legislative instrument to create jobs for Nigeria's teaming youth as well as provide affordable health care and security for all Nigerians. President of the Senate, Godswill Akbabion, Speaker of the House of Representatives, Tajuddin Abbas, stated this as the officially unveiled an eight-point legislative agenda for the 10th House, just before Tuesday's plenary. National Assembly correspondent Mitairi Ikbeng completes the report. The legislative agenda of the 10th House of Representatives provides focal areas for legislation and intervention in tandem with the renewed hope agenda of the federal government. So the challenge is in the 10th National Assembly both chambers today, is that we must perform better than all the past National Assemblies put together. All committees are requested to integrate the agenda to their respective work plans. Members should also ensure that legislative proposals, including bills, motions, etc., are in line with the provision of this agenda. And expectations are high. As partners, therefore, we are in a new position to jointly serve the people better. Plenary begins with a new member, Abubakar Yahya Kusada, representing Kankia Ingawa Kusada Federal Constituency from Katsina State, taking his oath of office. Thereafter, lawmakers demand investigations into the cancellation of visas granted 264 Nigerians on arrival in Saudi Arabia, as well as the model of a Nigerian medical student in the Philippines. The House or the government of the Republic of Nigeria to, as a matter of urgency, take such diplomatic steps as may be necessary to protect the image of, of the nation. We should mandate the Committee on Foreign Affairs, Human Rights and Diaspora to follow up this investigation of the untimely death Mr. Chibrike Emmanuel in questionable circumstance in the Philippines. The House passed the bill for an act to establish the Institute of Economists of Nigeria, while the bill for an act to establish the Federal University of Medical and Health Sciences, Item Bende Abia State, scaled second reading. If we do not provide means to produce professionals in this sector, God forbid, one day, we will also be importing health professionals from other uh, uh, countries. Lawmakers also sponsored infrastructure motions that were adopted by the House for Legislative Action. Also asked the Ministry of Water Resources to include the construction and dragging of water channels to connect Magada Sabangira Amada Water and the Father Dem Pedro constituency of Kano State in the 2024 budget estimate. From the National Assembly, Mitaire Ikben, NTA News.